Hey guys, uh, so this is uh, my first foray into video blogging. Um, so, you know, I guess I introduce uh, myself as uh, my name is Sang. Uh, my full name is Chen Sang. Um, I'm in Laos. Um, and if you don't know who Lao people are or Laotians, uh, you can actually get a nice documentary by a cartoon called King of the Hill. It has a really good. Um, Documentary there. No, I'm just kidding. You won't know who we really are just from that, but it's really funny. It put us on the map at least. Uh, this is a um, Laos is a very um, small country. It's about the size of California, um, uh, with and how do you say, I guess in length, and um, very still underdeveloped. I can say it's still lots of mountains and and jungle. So uh, uh, so. In any case, the reason why I want to start video blogging is because I, I came to a very big decision to go into the monastery to be a Buddhist monk full time. Um, and uh, so, therefore, I want to put out as much content as possible uh, and reach as much people as possible and be the best that I can be and, and share some things uh, and share some of the ideas that I had been brewing deep inside me. And, uh, you know, I don't want to be lost. So maybe out in the internet world you can be caught. So um, to start off, uh, shout out to the person who actually uh, told me to go ahead and do this here is uh, my best friend, my love, um, the person who um, totally understands me probably the most, probably even more than my family I have to say. It's kind of strange and it's something that I probably want to talk about later on in some other video that I'm going to do it. So, uh, so what kind of message do I want to put out? Well, some of the content I want to put out is um, the, the philosophy, Buddhist philosophy. Um, I, tr I, I left um, the monastery um, a few years ago and um, I felt like I had some loose ends to tie, um, student debt being one of them, um, and uh, you know, certain connections. I wanted to make sure that they were tied uh, before I decided to do this full time. And um, so the things I learned at the monastery at the time, um, I applied it. To be a different person, to be a new person, to be a better person, and um, I'm not trying to um, be the guru or the uh, a, a spiritual teacher for anybody like that. But um, what uh, what I found is what applied to me, is the truth to me. So if it resonates with you, sure you can use that too and kind of validate what you're feeling too. Um, but if it doesn't, you know, just don't say that I'm uh, I'm trying to sway you in any way. You just you are who you are love yourself too. Um, other things I may want to talk about is the Laotian culture itself. Um, being uh, uh, being uh, an American born, US citizen, uh, second generation uh, uh, Buddhist that you know, my family fled uh, after the Vietnam War, um, going into the refugee camp and coming here into the States being sponsored by a Baptist uh, family. I uh, love them very much. I mean, they helped us um, change our lives and everything of that nature. Um, and people talking about the culture of me, you know, because it's so ingrained with Buddhist um, philosophy, um, it, it almost feels like it's going to be natural that I may be talking about both at the same time. Um, other topics I may talk about, um, things that really resonated with me, touched me a lot, and I really want to put out, you know, my ideas, expressions, uh, things like climate change, global warming, um, money, debt, um, the concept of money, um, <laughs> maybe even dating as an Asian American, which I see a lot on on YouTube, and uh, some are even pretty recent, you know, some are like, oh, you know, a girl may ask, do Asian men like, you know, black, eight, Spanish, or all women, and all that stuff there, and guys are guys, you know? uh, but we'll talk about that in a long time, um, and then you've seen the guys too, but other things I may want to talk about is the cooking, I'm a self-taught cook, um, I just, I, I think cooking is an art, you can see that the artwork that's behind me on the table here, um, it's not quite it down, you won't be able to see it, but uh, some of the things I want to put out is the artwork that I've been stories, comic books. Um, I want to put out some comic books. I want to be, uh, some of it's going to be adult humor um, that I'm going to be putting out. It's going to be pretty new. My buddy, um, Victor, he, uh, he's so freaking funny. It's a pin uh, uh, We're going to probably put it out. We may even act it out. I don't even know how it's going to go, but it's going to be kind of um, wild off the whim type of thing there. Um, but it's just going to be funny. Kind of. Uh, uh, I think it's going to be, I don't want it so... Um, so much that it's like R-rated or anything like that. But I do want to put, make like, uh, you know, adult comics. Um, I always had that uh, a sense of humor of that nature. Uh, I 
do have a comic series that I want to put out too that was um, inspired by The Last of Us and your new, new setting and all that stuff there, just the concept. Um, at the time I was very dark, I was a very dark person, so the story made me pretty dark as well. I had about um, five or six issues that are out, and I'll put them out there, maybe I'll put out like a few pages at a time. Um, maybe out, maybe I just put the whole thing out, you know, I try to do it as like a, maybe bi-weekly, um, yeah, yeah bi bi-weekly kind of series or something like that. Um, considering I only have like a few months left and I have about six issues and there's more to the story that I want to put out and hopefully, you know, if it goes out, maybe somebody can take it on and, uh, and move forward, whether it be Naughty Dog, I'm not trying to make money off of you um, because I'm going to be a, in the monastery, I'm going to be a monk, so I don't think I'm going to take any of the royalties, I'm not supposed to take any of that stuff anyway, if it happens from YouTube or whatever you know, content you can put out on. Um, and the other uh, comic book series that I'm doing, um, I have a, a lot, it has a lot to do with what I've been feeling for the past couple of years and the transition to the lifestyle that I have, um, that, that, it's unfinished work, but I want to put it out, I have character designs, I have all this stuff here, and hopefully, um, it gets put out too, it, um, it really resonated with me, it really hit me when I was, uh, tutoring, uh, someone. So, um, other things I may talk about is hiking too. I, I'll talk about the hiking and camping experiences. Um, uh, all my friends here, it's only a couple people who are willing to go camping and hiking this late in winter. It's currently February. It's, we had two winter, two winter vortexes in the past few month, few weeks, um, where there's snow and uh, negative um, temperatures, uh, well below uh, zero. I'm pretty sure most of you heard about those uh, stories about the Midwest and it, it hit us in New England um, and yeah I, I'm, I'm likely to have that New England accent where it may not pronounce my R's so I try to but if I'm not paying attention you can catch me and um, catch me on a better time you can get my Asian accent even though it's American born. <laughs> um, so yeah um, uh, what else I going to say here shout out to um, my buddy Tui just sent me a message. We're gonna go um, this weekend uh, to Mount Monadnock in New Hampshire. It's only 3,200 feet, but again, um, it's uh, it should have some snow. I should have my current bonds and my equipment that I want to bring and make sure that I'm prepared because uh, the last time I went, I went with Dorothy, um, again my best friend. Uh, this was a few years ago. We went. There was ice and all that stuff there. We were careful. We didn't summit, but we went pretty close, and uh, we didn't have the summit fever. I mean, we, we wanted to be safe. It was very icy. Um, just come back down safely and I'm pretty much going to do the same thing with Tui we're going to go up and uh, another shout out to um, my buddy Van Van we didn't play on the same team but we played volleyball together airsoft and all that stuff there um, I don't know which uh, kind of content I'm going to put out what saying you're going to see so which saying is you already seeing um, all you know is that I'm going to be healthy so Thing I'm gonna go with this name here is the healthy sandwich. Take a bite of the healthy sandwich. <laughs> so, thank you so much for listening. Catch you next time.